reaction, not you, was me. I told you that. How many more times do I have to tell you? That I... was me, my betrayal, my fault. Okay, but that doesn't help. It doesn't. What will help? What do you want? What else do I have to sacrifice for you, Ken? I think you should leave, Zach. Zach, there is a little girl hanging over our heads. She will never, ever go away. How in the hell can you grieve for your faraway daughter and still want to be with me? I made a choice. Yeah, but clearly you're heartbroken. Working through it. Well, I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear about it. You did exactly what you wanted to do, okay? So live with it. I have to. Now, when you decide what you want from me, you let me know, all right? That's amazing to me. In his world, nobody else counts but him. You are dead wrong. My husband is the most generous man I have ever known. Yeah, generous with his sperm, maybe. Brian, part of the reason that, that Zach donated was, was to make up for all the horrible things his brother did. Remember, Bianca's first child was conceived in rape. And Zach felt like he had to compensate for that somehow. He's a rock for the people that he cares about. There's nothing he wouldn't do to help them. I used to love him for that. You used to love him for that? What about now? Thanks. Well, now he... He cares about too many people. Bianca, Gabrielle, Reese. I've never been very good at sharing, as you know, and I don't think I ever will be. I want Zach to belong to me and the boys. That's it. I want the Zach exclusive I used to have. So then why don't you explain this to him? Well, that's an excellent question. Kendall, what are you doing here, pouring your heart out to Ryan instead of to the husband who loves you more than life? You're back. Good. I, I, um, I owe you an apology, Brat. I mean, I never even asked where you were injured. Was it Iraq or Afghanistan? I mean, not, not that it's any of my business. It's, it's just that I, um, I know I'm not the only person who has ever been hurt in this world. And, um, in fact, I... I've heard a lot of other people recently. The love of my life, our family, our friends, and... I just feel like if I reached out to them now, it would be manipulative. You know, I'd be using my accident as a way to make them feel guilty, and they just don't deserve that. You know? <laughs> and so now here I am, and... I know there's just no one left. Well, there's me. Why? Where is Brock? I don't know. But it sounds like talking to him helped you. God, you let me go on and on. You know what? Zach, my feelings, they are none of your business. Yeah, just relax. Put your head down. Take a deep breath. Come on, don't tell... Deep breath? What is with the deep breaths? If somebody tells me one more time to, to take a deep breath, I'm going to go running and screaming up and okay, down the halls. an idea. Don't take a deep breath. How about that? This isn't going to work. Thanks for the loaner. Anything else that I can do? Uh, you can give her a moment alone with her mother. So what are you thinking? 
here, along with Ryan, candlelight, in Ryan's shirt. What's wrong with you? Oh, come on, please, please, don't start now, okay? It was, it was perfectly innocent. My, my shirt got soaked. I, I don't understand. Why, why does everyone think I'm, I'm having some affair with Ryan? I don't know. You and his shirt, candles burning, not exactly a setup for gin rummy. I repeat, what is wrong with you, Kendall? Why does there have to be something wrong with me? You are not yourself. You haven't been, okay? Ever since the coma. Well, I've had a bit to absorb, haven't I? I think what you have had is a beautiful marriage and a beautiful family. I mean, Zach would give you the moon if you asked him for it. Yes, he's made mistakes, but he has never wavered for one moment in his love for you. Not many women are cherished like that. And yet lately you act like, I mean, you don't even seem to be participating. Zach can't fix his marriage all by himself. Why don't you just give him a hand? You're right. You are absolutely right. I'm leaving. Um, just tell Ryan. Go, go. I, I will tell Ryan. Okay. Okay. Mm. Go ahead. Mission accomplished. Kendall's gone. Well, Ryan, I mean, certainly you didn't expect Kendall to stay the night. My fiance just drowned in an icy river, and you think that I'm chasing after Kendall? Look, Ryan, I, I don't really know what to think. What I know is that you're in a very vulnerable place right now. Kendall and I love Greenlee very much. That's why she was here. And, and I know that you didn't share in that affection for Greenlee. I mean, really, she was more the more of a nuisance to you than anything else. And you just try to be nice to her for Jack's sake, right? Okay, but that doesn't mean that... that... You couldn't even give her one moment of happiness. It was tough for you, wasn't it? I mean, even her shower, you ruined her, her wedding shower by inviting her mother. Oh, come on, Ryan. Let's, let's not go and there. You tried to take her company from her, tried to kick her out. I mean, you're probably celebrating right now, aren't you? Ryan, don't make this ugly. Actually... Greenlee and I made peace with everything. I, you completely misunderstand me here. No, I... I think I understand you just fine. Ryan, I thought we were friends. We were. Not now. I'd like you to go. Ryan. Please. I want you to go. Place. I'm out of here. Help me find my clothes. I'll go find Brot. No, I don't want Brot, okay? He's, he's a terrific guy, but he's not going to help me get out of here. And I'm guessing you aren't either, so you know what? I, I will handle this. I'll handle it all on my own. Hey, hey, hey. I'm not going anywhere. Yeah. Thank you for coming today. Listen, we have some uh, business we need to take care of. Uh, you and I don't have any business, Jay. Actually, Ryan, we do, because Greeny left a will. Oh, well, whatever she left me, you can just give it away, okay? How about that? Are you sure you want to give Erica a chance to steal Greenlee's baby? Greenlee's baby? What are Cute. you talking about? Greenlee left you her share. She wanted to leave them to Kendall, but when Kendall fell into that coma, she changed her will. Yeah, but Kendall's better now. So. Yes, thank God. But at the time, that looked less than likely, so... So, wait a minute. 
I would be Kendall's partner. Yes, if you'd be interested in running a cosmetics firm. I could be interested. 